once again, the CARP flag was raised with pride here at Toronto City Hall and several other cities across the country as we honour National Seniors Day and the United Nations International Day of the Older Person. CARP is first and foremost an advocacy group that speaks on behalf of Canadians as we age to make sure that the politicians are paying attention and seniors' issues are on the forefront of their agenda. Our responsibility at the City of Toronto is to ensure that our seniors are free of harassment and threat, to be financially secure, and to have safe, affordable housing, transit, recreational programs. To live in dignity and respect, Toronto must be fully accessible and age-friendly city. We are now 40,000 members strong. We are aging better. There's a larger quality of life. People are living longer. Accessibility is a major issue here in Toronto. Uh, and we are so excited to be partnering with Luke Anderson and the Stop Gap Foundation. What kind of grade do you give the city at this point in regards to accessibility? We have a long way to go. I would say more than uh, two thirds of of businesses here in the city have stepped entryways. Our new low floor streetcars, uh, there's only 30 of, of them out of the 200 streetcars that, that operate on 14 lines. Over half of, of the 69 subway stations are, are not accessible. You can learn more about CARP's advocacy platforms, membership discounts and community events at carp.ca. Here at Toronto City Hall, I'm Darren Maharaj for Zoomer News.